Hi, this is Johnny Bergen with another Chicago Blues guitar lesson. This time we're going to do something a little bit different. This is for my Patreon subscribers out there, and I want to thank all you guys. They were sort of excited about the idea of just playing along to a backing track as kind of a fluency lesson part two, which is really, you know, we've done about a hundred videos of some of the uh, all the greats and the nooks and crannies of blues guitar, like whether you're talking about Sun Seals, Brewer Phillips, Sammy Lawhorn, Eddie C. Campbell, on and on. Luther Tucker, Eddie Taylor, Earl Hooker, Luther Johnson, both of them. I mean, Snake Boy and also um, Guitar Junior Johnson, and so on and so on. So the question is, now what, right? I mean, what are you going to do IRL here? right? So I'm going to just play along to a real typical backing track. Actually, these are way better than typical. These are my friends Butternote backing tracks from the UK. Thanks a lot for doing these great tracks and they're really fun to practice too. So what I'm going to try doing now is all this stuff, I'm going to try synthesizing it in a real, like a real world kind of, you know, situation that you might actually find yourself in. So are you ready? For the blues. Somebody say yeah. Somebody scream. Okay. Okay. Get a raw note, keep going. A little bit of sun seals. You can back off, play a chord.
Bring it home. Well, all right. So what happened with all that? Hopefully that was almost a little bit of memory lane with a little bit of a sun seals. And stuff like this. Which is Luther Tucker style stuff. And I just mixed it up. I hope that this might inspire you and it might seem doable. You can play these nice chords. And then some of these Sammy Law horns, I like to do that. So I, I really, uh, I played a bit of the leading brand by Earl Hooker in there. So this is nice, it's like off the uh, first finger on the E string, E note here on the D string. Um, Fenton Robinson does that in that uh, song, Directly From My Heart To You, you know. But I think he does that in a different key, but it really, it puts all these uh, chord shapes together. And then I did a lot of good stuff here. Good first finger bends. Remember that from Guitar Junior. So this is kind of a review lesson, and I certainly can't even remember what I played in there. But um, it all kind of fit. So I just relaxed into the groove, and... Um, and then I thought back... Uh, that, so that's all like the Luther Tucker stuff from Sweet Home Chicago. Then I started thinking, gee, about that nice, real pretty Lewis Meyer stuff where, where in, in Steady Groove he does like... Beautiful. So I thought, put some of that in there, you know. So anyway, that's the point of all these lessons that I've done for all this time is to get to where you can mix and match the way you feel like it, where it comes out in a nice way. Hey, want to try another one? Here's a T-Bone Walker shuffle. Um, G, key of G. More Lewis Myers. Bobby King. Okay, let's try a different tone. Little Matt Murphy there. Fingertips. Wrong notes, keep going, man. That's a slick position that I got from a hooker ride, hooker ride. There's nothing I played that didn't come out of one of these lessons, but that's because they all inspire me. I'm drawn from my inspirations, and you can draw from your inspirations. So just like listen to that groove and then try some different things as it goes along and the great thing about the backing track you got more time 
two up. You can answer yourself in different octaves, experiment with different phrase lengths, and have fun. So I'm going to make this one kind of short and sweet. And, you know, I'm sorry there's not a lot of super concrete things. Do this, do that, because this is a synthesis lesson. And I tried to synthesize some of the things that I've talked about over the last two years um, in these great uh, Butternote backing tracks. So I hope that this will inspire you to start thinking about how can I synthesize what I already know and what I'm already trying to learn. And uh, don't worry, we'll go back to the deep dives. Got a lot of good stuff uh, coming up ahead. Got um, Wayne Bennett coming up before too long. I want to do something about Fenton Robinson. I'd come back to him since he just got inducted in the Blues Hall of Fame, like Texas Flood. Keep the requests and the comments coming, and um, keep picking and stay in touch. Do subscribe to my YouTube channel and join me on Patreon. All right, see you guys next time.